We are currently at a rest area out in Arizona called Meteor Crater Rest Area. I don't know if you can see the smoke up there. There was a truck that exploded. One of those semi trucks. Oh, look, look, see the rabbit? Honey, look, 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 there, look, see the rabbit? See him? There's a jackrabbit running off there by the, the, um, there, he just ran across there, look, look. He's over there by the gate. They live here. Those are all over this desert. And I don't know if you guys saw the jackrabbit run across here out in the desert. It looks like somebody's house is out here. They actually have a house right by the rest area here. It looks like a house. And over that way somewhere, there's a little exit for a road. Maybe this dirt road. It could even be this dirt road. I don't know. But there's an area called Meteor Crater. I mean, you know, it's a historic site. It's a, um, I guess a meteor hit here. I was hoping we could see it from this rest area, but we can't. So this is what the Meteor Crater rest area looks like. We are up on this rock here, and there's um, a marker that they placed here on the stone. I was going to write my name up here, but I see some other people beat me to it, but it's actually not a good thing to do. You're kind of defacing things. <laughs> So, I decided not to, not to write Dinoy was here. But Dinoy was here, <laughs> so we did get it on video. And here's some rainwater that has fallen here. So this is um, rainfall, uh, rainwater, and it's cold. At the Meteor Crater Rock, at the rest area. And, you know, on our way here, we were driving by and we saw this smoke. That's Highway 40 here. We're heading out. I actually think that's snow up there in the mountains, in the mountain peaks. Over there. See? I think that's snow. We just passed, um, I think we just passed, no, we haven't gotten to Flagstaff yet. We haven't even gotten to Flagstaff yet. Flagstaff would be a bigger town. But we just passed the road there for Grand Canyon. So you go that way and then you turn up north to head towards the Grand Canyon. But on our way there, we saw all this smoke. And on the other lane, the westbound lane, there was a truck that had exploded. I don't know what happened, but it looks like the cargo area was smoking. So something in the back might have fell down. I hope the driver's okay. I don't even remember seeing the cab. But there was so much smoke and you could smell the smell of burning. Now, I'm looking here, and I see, I don't know if that's water storage over there, these rocks. It's kind of interesting because you got mostly flat range around here, but then suddenly you have all these outcroppings of um, this red rock out here. So, we're going to go ahead and head back on to continue our journey, but I uh, just want to take a little break. Oh, and, of course, we got the trains there. You know, trains are, like, really important out here. I think they help to transport the goods across the whole country. So we may be seeing more trains coming up. The route we're planning on taking is to head towards Albuquerque. And then from there we're probably going to head towards um, Amarillo, Texas. And then head back towards Florida from, from that location. But here's the people that were here that ended up writing their stuff. Might be kids, I don't know. Looks like drawing from little kids. So this is really cool, really neat. And um, hopefully you'll see me, if, if I decide to take the detour there, I'm, I'm hoping to take a detour to Winslow, Arizona, to do a little photo opportunity there. We'll see what happens. We might pass it, but if I end up there, that's where you'll see me reporting in next. Now, interestingly here, you can see this rock bubbled up before. So this rock had some kind of gases escaping from it. I know that I'm not in a van, but I thought I'd share the dream here. You can see somebody here with a really nice van. Looks like they have air conditioning on top. I don't know if that's a hand there holding up a camera, <laughs> filming. I don't know if that's what they're doing, but looks like they're van dwellers here, and I just wanted to share what some people actually do, a lot of people seem to be doing. 
That is a very nice van. It's a road track SS here. Very nice van. And uh, traveling around the country, taking in the sights and sounds. We're getting ready to hit Winslow. I plan on making a stop there for gasoline and standing on a street corner in Winslow, Arizona. <laughs> We're not going to stay very long, but um, definitely want to make a stop. You can't pass through Winslow and not go stand on a street corner, right? Alright, believe it or not, I actually am having a hard time finding Winslow. The GPS said Winslow, but it didn't look like there's anything here. <laughs> Although, I see a mail truck there. There's a mail truck there in the distance. See the mailman? So this has to be Winslow. Um, I'm basically looking for a street corner to stand next to and have my wife film me here. Maybe get a picture. <laughs> What's Park Drive? by the McDonald's here. <laughs> so uh, we have evidently passed uh, Flagstaff, I forgot that, and now we're heading uh, east towards uh, Albuquerque on Highway 40 there. And I'm on the street corner here in Winslow, Arizona, standing here, looking at the cars pass by. <laughs> And I'm uh, going to ask my wife to take a, a little picture of me here. <laughs> so here I am on a street corner in Winslow, Arizona. <laughs> we are currently at the Painted Desert Indian Center, just off Highway 40 here past Winslow, heading towards Albuquerque, New Mexico. You see Highway 40 right there in the distance. And there are dinosaurs here, and um, Indian villages, all sorts of stuff here to look at. You see this big dinosaur just attacked a little triceratop. Please stay off the dinosaur. 